I always want to help people since I was young. This was taken in our last year of high school back home in Myanmar. I always wanted to be a scientist. Very late at high school, I fell in love with biology. Cumberland College, where I studied my journey in New Zealand. Guy from Myanmar, never been away from home. I was culture shock, homesick, place where I learned how to work together with people from diverse backgrounds. I did my uh, BSc Honours in Genetics and I got my PhD in Microbiology in 2013. My first graduation and my PhD graduation. My parents were at my graduation and I can make my parents proud of me as well. <laughs> I went home and I ran into a tuberculosis patient. After talking to this patient, I realised that even though he is getting the treatment, it may not be enough for him to survive. I realised that this is my calling. I want to work on tuberculosis. Is that what you'd expect for a TB? Like that's uh, the right size? TB is informally known as a disease of poverty. Every 20 seconds, someone dying from tuberculosis. We have evidence using genome sequencing, and that evidence shows that current approach is not working. We need a better approach. New Zealand is considered one of the countries with uh, low TB cases. Having said that though, when you look at the particular ethnicity, there are disproportionate high rate of TB. When you look at our Maori community, Pacific community, or even refugee community. We also need to include how to support if one of your family member is having uh, TB. I work very closely with communities affected by TB and also um, working with policymaker. Policymaker can make the decision based on evidence. And those evidence actually come in from working together with the community. So that way you are really addressing what the community needs. Since one of our specific liaisons was in the department, specifically postgrad, and I fell in love with what he is as a supervisor, like how he loves to change the health inequities and kind of make it a balanced world. It only takes one person to create a change, and I want to be a part of that. And I am a part of that, being the only Polynesian within this department. I believe that the best people to make a difference in the community are people from the community dancer. That's why I am empowering next generation of leaders, researchers from the communities. I'm immensely grateful for the support I have received so far during my journey in New Zealand. And because of that, the power of empowerment, I am able to give back to the community at home and also the community that helped me grow in New Zealand as well.